he just put that there? What is this? Weird. Employee badge. Okay. Another gear crate. Great. Oh, wait. Isn't this the thing that's normally... Oh, somebody already did this. No, someone already did this. Oh, this is great. I think I can... Uh, if I do this quick enough... Oh, I don't think it's on. Shoot. It's totally not on. Um... I thought if this was active, then I thought it would work. So what we're gonna what we normally do is you would click this. Oh, it just reset. But you know what? You know what, buddy? Screw you. I'm gonna go over here. And instead of taking your ass across here and using two fuses, jump my ass up here. Well then. So first thing we do is go in here. Get all the important stuff. That's the door on the outside. Uh, I think we can go down, but I don't think I want to do that. I think I want to go up here. Go down the hole. Nope. Is there any form of stealth in this game? Not really. There's like range combat and stuff, and and there's some things that play into that, but there's not really, I don't think there's really any kind of stealth. At least not right now. There is crouching and stuff, and you can kind of go slower, but. And there's a backstab mechanic as well. But I generally don't really walk around backstabbing people in this game. It doesn't really feel like it's that kind of game, but you can backstab. If you get close enough. I think... Oh, wait. Do you have to have a certain type of weapon, or do you just walk up behind him and hit F? You can tell I do it a lot, right? Crouch, backstabbing, and using a bow crossbow, and you can take out entire complexes without enemies knowing you're there. Yeah, see, that's that's more of, like, the range thing, I think. I think you can do that with, with like, a, a, a sniper as well. Um... But, I mean, maybe there's stealth stuff that plays into that, too. Oh, it's another one of these things. Dude, that is so cool. He just pops out. It's great. Now we know to go for the big guy first. Little guy dead? Great. That time I actually had my uh, dude out auto-attacking. Great. Did I just get a blue AK? Hmm. Great, that's blue now. Or green now. Awesome. Uh, all right, let's go down here. Next stop. Ilias. Uh, SK Buds with the nine months. Thank you so much. Currently watching your Jedi Fallen Order gameplay on YouTube and loving it. Keep the YouTube playthroughs coming. Also wondering when you will finish Pacific Drive. I do not know. 
I do not know when we are going to finish Pacific Drive, but I'd like to. But I don't know when. I appreciate you. Thank you. <laughs> um, from the Discord last night. While we work on fixing this bot thing, we have a temporary solution. I've just authorized 20,000 codes to be given away via content creators from the Once Human Content Creator Program. We just received the news a few minutes ago, so give them some time to catch up. But are looking, if you're looking for some codes, head over to your favorite content creator social channels. And with some luck, you can be a receiver of the Once Human Beta Codes. Okay. I, I think I'm in the Once Human Content Creator Program. Um... Maybe I have to go to the website and claim them? I certainly didn't get a, an email about it. Huh. Hey, Guardians, are you in here, bud? Do you know anything about this? Hmm. Oh, so, Ko, sorry. They said all Once Human Contact creators except for Ko. Oh, was that in there too? Shoot. Well, that makes more sense then. All right. Um, cool. I think it's on Lurk It. I was going to take a quick look in here and see if, like, I have a... Starry Studio has accepted your application to the Once Human Contact Creator Program. Cool. Is it Program? Claim your keys here. Close beta test. Oh, wait, is this just like my personal key? Oh. 4 6 2024. This was yesterday. Each of you should have 15 beta. Okay, okay, hold on. I think I actually have some codes. It's not 500, but hey, I'll take 15. I'll take anything to give to you guys. Um. Uh, I, I clicked the button. It didn't take me. One sec. I've never used this system before. I'm going to try to get the keys over to a mod. And then we'll go from there. I don't see the keys in there. Um... Yeah, sorry guys, we're gonna have to do this later. I, I, this is, I've never used this website before and it's not exactly intuitive. Hmm. Okay. Guardian Angel says some people reporting a few issues. Yeah, I'm not able to get these. Huh. Bummer. Oh well. All right, sorry guys, I will try to get more information and get some keys to give away at some point. Uh, I don't know when that's going to be, but I will try to get you something as soon as I can. I can walk you through it. Guardians, it's not an issue of walking through it. I, I clicked everything I could click, it didn't work. <laughs> the, the stuff, it's pretty, I mean, it's, it's obviously, it's obvious how it's supposed to work, it's just not working how it's supposed to. Yep. Mm. That's okay. Let's go see if we can make this AK, and then we'll, uh... Actually, is there a teleporter down there anywhere? You can teleport to Myers Market. No. Target point locked. Let's drive down to Myers Market and see if maybe we can uh, unlock the control point there. Guardian says, fair enough. I had no issues myself. That's why. Okay. Um, so, yeah, like, what what I do... And I'll just, I'll just say this to you. Um, like, if I go to Lurk It, I can see the program... I click the Starry Studios thing, and then I click Visit Program, and then it says Content Creator Beta Code. Each of you should have 15 codes. And then there's a link, and it says Go and Disperse. And then I click the link, and that just takes me right back to the Content Creator Program. The exact same screen that I clicked through at the beginning. So it's like it's not going anywhere. Yeah. Co needs hand holding to go through a website now. Yep. Getting older, chat, you know, comes with the age. Comes with the age. What are you gonna do? I'm basically ancient. You gotta give me a break. Ow. Great. 
need those hides badly. Oh, needs hides badly. Mm hmm. Lurk it has been messing up. They're trying to fix it so we can get the codes. Yeah, it does. It, de it definitely feels like a lurk it problem. Yeah, for sure. I haven't really used Lurkit too much in the past, so. Funny enough, every time I seem to, it doesn't seem to work properly. It, it may just be that my... <laughs> it may just be that my timing is bad. I don't use it too often, so. Alright, let's do this. Go as a professional dingus? I am. Yep, that's what I do. I be a dingus. Try to check your actives on the left and see your mission kit. Active on the left. We'll give you this nice music to listen to. I didn't see that. Dude, this is so hosed. The top under missions is just like I don't even this this this. I don't know what's going on, man. Do I have to like join the Discord mission for Discord access? I don't even. <laughs> I feel like Starry Studios needs a guy for this, <laughs> like a paid person on their team that can help with this stuff. Um. Yeah, they're not doing it normally by any means. They're doing all sorts of weird stuff. Park on the side of the road, not in the middle. I am not doing that. Oh, here. One sec. Gotta go deer hunting, chat. You know how it is. Woo. First time chatter, but I watch many of your YouTube videos and game reviews, and I've been seeing a lot of this game. I've been wanting to try it. Thoughts? Uh, yeah, game's awesome. I, I've really been enjoying it. Been having a good time with it. It's currently in closed beta test 3 and supposed to come out at the end of this year, around Q3. Uh, a great co-op looter shooter in a very weird sci-fi environment. I've been having a great time with it, and it's improving every beta test by pretty significant amount. So, yeah, it's if you like, um, if you like looter shooters, online multiplayer looter shooters, like this is pretty clearly for you. What is this little town? Oh, it's like a food town. Okay, we're just gonna go around it. Hi, bus. Ooh, this is fine. This is fine. Anyway, has Co seen the Outward, outward 2 uh, trailer? I have. Yeah, I'm super excited for hours too. Yeah, Guardian Angels. It just seems like in a situation like this, there should be like a, you know, a guy with a, a, a Google Doc of keys that's ready to step in at a moment's notice and get it out. You know what I mean? Yeah. Sorry, little deer. Mm -mm. The wait, wait, wait. The bus loot is daily. What do you mean? The bus loot? What are you talking about? Bus loot? I go back to the bus? I don't think I've done the bus event. You can follow the bus, it stops sometimes. Well, apparently he's coming to us. All right, bus. Do we shoot it? Do I shoot the bus? Does the bus be bussing? That was cool. The, the bus just came up and like offered me loot and is now leaving. I love this bus. 
I actually am, I am in love with this bus. Bus friend. Same thing with the walking house. It's a daily. Oh, cool. Okay, I didn't I didn't realize any of that. So that's awesome. Oh, it's was sent. Love it, dude. Thank you very much, and I appreciate your 37, buddy. Sent always writes us an awesome poem every time he resubs. This is 37th one. Freaking love it. Nice. There we go. I should put that up for longer. Hold on. There we go. Give people some time to read it. Kisser of Moms with the T1 sub. That is an excellent name. Thank you very much for that, dude. I appreciate it. Did I beat Final Fantasy VII R? No, not yet. I'm gonna be really leaning into that now that we've finished up with Dragon's Dogma 2. Ah, oh, missed him. Is this the next big thing? It could be. If it keeps going the, the direction it is, it absolutely could be. Is there a drop frame today? There is. At 1 p.m. ET. I have any specialization? Oh. Oh, that's not this is this is different. We want here. I have 26 ciphers available. Wow. I have two more. Gravel and log on the go. When this item is in your backpack, 30 to 60% weight on all log scravel and ores. Oh, wow. Disassembly bench yields 50% for metal scrap and electronic parts. That's good. Wood structures built from wood gain the tough plant effect and durability plus 150%. Let me go with this one. Yep. Disassembly bench yield 30% when disassembling, uh, disassembling parts, fabrics, and plastics. 30 to 60% chance to recover mixed explosives after using high explosive grenades and molotovs. One to three portions of spoiled food will be transformed into fresh mushrooms or fertilizer of a random type every five to ten minutes. Yeah, do that. Pick up a bunch of food that rots. Cool. Okay, that's fun. Yeah, all those are random for each player, which is a lot of, which is like, that's super cool. I love that. Bronze pickaxe, oil refining. What about that? Can we make steel? I don't think we can make steel yet. I'm going a little too quick there. Intermediate tools. Intermediate gear. Synthesis. We need to actually make all this stuff. I don't really need a lot here. Draft cannon, leap to higher ground. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but that's cool. I wish there was a way to re-roll those specializations or expand upon them. Oh yeah, dude, this specialization system is brand new. It needs a lot of work. It needs a lot of work. I agree. It's a it's a excellent, excellent new thing. And and I really hope they keep like leaning into it hard because it's it's very cool but it needs a lot of work yeah. okay 
What is that? When I think back, we always stand together. I can still see their faces. I wish I could see them again. I can still see their faces. Oh. It's un puzzle. That was easy. <laughs> okay. Cool. Light reflex sight. Great. Maybe for a pistol or something? Yeah. Bummer. Oh well. We go again! Mm -mm. Oh, I can't I can't do that. He was coming right for us, Chad. I had no choice. Mm -mm. No choice. No mas, chat. No mas. No mas. Esta no bueno. Is that tin? Oh god, another one! It's okay, guys, I got this! Oh, thank god we got him. Dude, another one! What, it's, a, it's a pandemic! Okay. It's a fondemic. Good job, Co. Thanks. Thank you. Help and make this world a safer place. Chad. Insuray, thank you so much. I finished and enjoyed DD2, but one pain point for me was the combat was massively simplified from one DA with far less abilities and ability slots. Do you find this limitation annoying or do you not notice it? I did not find that limitation too noticing. Um, I do not really ever enjoy simplification, so I, I'm of course not a fan of that. But that being said, um, I did find the combat in DD2 very, very enjoyable myself. I really liked it. So, yeah, no, I, I had a great time. I think overall the combat was far improved. Yeah, overall. Yeah. But it was easy. It was far easier than the first game. Yeah. The, the first game was much, much, much easier. Excuse me. Second game was much, much easier. Granted, I feel like the game, I feel like DD1 really got hard in the expansion. So I'm, I'm guessing, you know, I'm hoping we'll get a DD2 expansion. A nice big girthy one. And uh, if that's the case, then hopefully we'll uh, be able to have some more fun with it. Oh, but Beth Bethesda's like the worst at simplification. I, I, I loathe that stuff. I hate it. I hate it. One of the worst things that can happen to games. Dragon Age is another great game that became super simplified. Yeah. What was my class of choice in DD2? Mystic Experian. Loved it. Did I finish Sons of the Forest? We're like 90% done with Sons of the Forest. I'm basically standing outside of the final area in Sons of the Forest. I, there is more exploring and stuff I can do, but I haven't decided if I'm going to do more exploring or just finish it. I'm planning on doing, I'm planning on finishing the forest eventually. So it will get done. I just haven't decided how I'm going to finish it yet. We'll see. Hey, Duddy, what's up, bud? You know you can put mods in your armor, right? I do. I just, my armor's trash right now, so I'm waiting to get good armor. What's it take on CBT3? Another great beta test, man. Feels good. Feels very good. Very much enjoying my time in this game. 
And I'm just playing it for fun. I mean, obviously, like, you know, I'm, I'm really, really looking forward to this game when it gets, uh, you know, when it's released, basically. Like, that's, that's what I'm going to get really excited for. Go to loot. All of the plantarinos. We need blueberries for something. I don't remember what exactly, but I remember going on a freaking blueberry trip in CBT2. contaminated water. Ooh, delicious. Love me some contamination. Mm. I just need blueberry seeds. I need one blueberry seed. Hopefully we can make it go from there. Incognito Cheeto. Good name. Like it. Although now that I hear that, I think that Incognito would have been a better name. Yep. I think I think the play was Incognito. I think that was the play. It's okay though. He can use that name on live. There's still a chance, chat. He can still save this. Hawthorne seed. Great. All right, so we got our blueberry seed, so we'll just keep going for now. How far are we? Oh. This way. There it is, right there. Isn't there... Is there not a tower here? Target point locked. Huh. Oh, there it is. All right. Let's go find this thing. Excellente. Hey, Azur. Hey, where'd this cutie come from? Let's chat. Oh, you don't talk. Hey, man, check it out. We've got all the parts and tools you could ever want sitting right here. Where do you get our parts from? Uh, I need something fixed up or stripped down for parts. I'm your gal. Specialized in fixing up pre-Starfall stuff. Okay. I just so happen to have a full of scrap right here. My shop isn't, it's not exactly rolling in cash right now. Let me take a look at what you got and I'll see if there's anything worth taking off your hands. How do I do that? Where's the actual shop? Huh. Okay. Maybe not. Hmm. Let's do this first. Now that we can actually teleport here, uh, let's go home. 